Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Spectacle Island 19. Yes, I said 19. Heh. <laughs> ah, long story, folks. But anyway, I am playing uh, hockey with uh, some gold here. Shame on me, right? Well, I was kind of lazy. Oh, I got one. As you look in the top corner, my money's kind of low. And that's unusual for me. No, it's not. I like spending money. Anyway, we got to get that money back up there. Got to get it back up there. But anyway, I don't know what this is going for. Let's check real quick. I am in the wrong one. I have been doing a, <laughs> a lot of contracts and stuff. Let's see. Where am I going? Oh, right here. Uh, been busy with a friend digging a trench for a water line. So I am sorry I'm behind on your comments. Oh, I could have sell better. Oh, I could sell better. I, I tell you what, we we going to drop these bad boys right here. Uh, we we want the best price for them, right? I just um, you're probably like Mr. Blue. Why you spread them out for? Uh, I got my reason, folks. I got my reason. I got some lag somewhere. I think I know where it's at, but um, this in here ain't quite ready yet. It's was that 198 liters but the what I'm gonna show y'all today is the update on the bridge which you can see down through here and then we're going to be doing some potato work potatoes 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 and more potatoes but as you can see uh, I did go in whoa my speeds way up um, I can got a mod in that uh, hide objects mod you can go in and just hit H and you hit enter and it'll take it away. Boom. Okay, it's it's still there but it's hidden. And there's no collision. Uh, I did some of that down here on these around the bridge here so it'll look better. But this is a bridge. It's a long one. It's a should be on Alien Gems Facebook page. I think that's where I got it from. Most likely it should be. I uh, haven't really had a chance to read any of the comments. I know there's a lot of them, folks, and I am really sorry. I'm behind, but my friend's waterline, they done it back in summer. And uh, he needed a 50-foot trench dug, probably about 15 inches deep by, I don't know, six. We, we didn't even have to go six inches wide, but. That's the wide of the shovel, so you know you pretty much have to go as wide as the shovel is when you're digging, unless you got a spade or something. But this bridge from up above. Sorry about that. I had to pause the video. I've got bad sinuses. They picked a cotton field in real life where I live at, and uh, my sinuses is all jacked up. But anyway, I just want to come in here and show you. Now what I done, <laughs> it, it'll take forever to explain this, but I went in GE. And when you go in GE for the first time, see like you cut all the trees I cut down? When you go in Giant's Editor, which is GE, not General Electric, but GE, as in Giant's Editor. Uh, for some reason, all the trees that you cut down is still in the map as original and you have to delete all of that well I accidentally deleted the water and I didn't know about it you know I saved it come back out and what I was doing was um, trying to figure out a way how I could get like right here this one's perfect if you go down through there look how perfect that is see yeah let's go over here yeah, I, oh, I gotta get all the water. There we go. This one, probably not quite so perfect. See there? I couldn't get that dirt amount done. I, I made a mistake going in GE, deleted the water, so I'm like, well, I'll just go, and go, go ahead and uh, cut that out. When I, when I loaded the game, you know, there wasn't no water nowhere. Well, I didn't know where my bridge is supposed to be at, so I cut that out good. And raise this dirt up right here 
and then I didn't mess with the this other side so I actually done the other side that's in this tool here you know well I'll see where I'm at now had a little spot here I had to fix but um I just brought this out like this and uh, raised it up on this end uh, done the other end well I went across here as small as I could then done this and then I uh, tried to level this back out which as you can see did not work like I planned but it's all right it's all right they can get through down here but anyway that's what I done on the bridge I pretty much got Giants editor caught up where all the trees is out so having said that you might still see a tree or two and that's not supposed to be there so these guys are done leveling this out so they're going to be going back over here and I'll show you the dirt work real quick uh, fill four I showed this in the last episode I think but I have to get caught up myself fill four is done we're waiting on the beans so we can get this finished we're gonna come over here smooth all this up level it down where it be kind of kind of good um, but yeah it's gonna be gonna be a lot of work there and a lot of money fuel and stuff for these guys got to keep them fueled up and of course you know I bought some ground and then uh, we got to explain this house here yeah this house is not movable folks it will not be removed uh, talk to Big Daddy Big Daddy talked to Alien Jim for me and Alien Jim Big Daddy said cannot remove it unless you go in like GE uh, object hider you know probably like well hide it with the object hider the house will disappear I want to show you but then again I don't because it'd be a lot of stuff I had to go back and redo but y'all see this right here this paneling or it's not paneling it looks like tar paper that they put down they put boards around it to hold the tar paper down I might be wrong but this little area right here where the tar paper is will not delete. There is not no trigger or nothing here that you can hit H to hide objects. You can do it on the house, but not on this piece right here. And, and, you see the top and third row scaplin? Scaplin, that's what I was trying to think of. Uh, you can delete the bricks and stuff here the cement but you cannot delete the third or the second row scaplin you can come in here I'm not going I'm not going to do it but see you can hide the scaplin here oh, come on there we go but up here you cannot and on this side you cannot so you can have house completely gone, and there'll be uh, and scaffolding completely gone. And there'll just be the second and third row scaffolding left, and this little piece here will still be here. But with this project, I have plans coming in the near future. Very near future, we got a couple of houses we got to tear down. Um, probably tearing this one down. Well, I know we'll be tearing this one down, but I gotta go in GE to do it. So. Stay tuned for the magical. I probably didn't say too much. Just say this house is going bye bye. That's all I'm going to say. Got this over here leveled out, folks. As you can see, it's the best I can. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you there's going to be some greenhouses coming here. Whoa, flying in a tree. I'm going to try to put down like three, maybe four greenhouses here. And then we might come in and knock out this shed and some of these trees here to put maybe one or two more greenhouses in here. And they'll be producing uh, tomatoes, cucumbers, lettuce, and stuff like that. 
But anyway, uh, we got some equipment we're going to have to get put away soon because we go in here and see where we're at. I need to fast forward so beans and soybeans, I mean soybeans and corn be ready to harvest. But after today, we have Wednesday till about, about 6 o'clock maybe, and it's going to be raining. So that's going to be a bummer. Cows, I mean pigs at 40, sheep's at 65, chickens are up to 68, gold, you know. And our cows are doing good at uh, nine. We need to up buy a load for them or something. But I want to come in here. We got to do some potatoes. So potatoes not good right now. They're usually at spring. So I don't know. We're probably going to sell a couple loads. And uh, yeah. But here's my potato mess. And we're fixing to get started on that. So here we go, folks. These, I can't remember what boxes are these from, um, modern these are from. Um, I had it on the tip of my, let's see, that is 500 liters. I like to go sell this box and some bags. You know, like bags. Yeah, we got bags of potatoes, folks. And if I can get one right here, this one right here. That's 500 liters. It is the same as this box right here. So that and this is the same amount. I want to test them to see which one we get the most, most money with. Supposed to be these. But these are a pain in the booty to fill. Uh, just come and look over here. See this mess I put on the ground? Yeah, you can't fill them when they're side by side like this. You're going to have to take them and spread them out some. Because your bucket does not recognize uh, them being side by side. And that is full. I ain't going to try to lift that. And, and uh, that's what we got auto load truck for, right? But, um... Yeah, Big Daddy, uh, I got one that produces bags. This is the potato shorter updater. Um, you're probably asking, well, how do I have both if it's the update? This is the old one. This one you got to load out in like a bucket or something. Fill it up here, you load it there, and I have not got no pig food out of it yet. Um... Can I get pig food out of it yet? Pig food. Um, no, I, I can't. I don't have enough yet. I only got 913 liters. I think when it gets to 1,000 liters, I can get. I can spawn one pallet. So that ain't quite ready for pig food yet. And we got to experience that too, folks, because uh, we've been talking about getting the pig food out of these. Ain't none of them up to par yet. Let me go ahead and dump this one right here. This one is pretty close. Well, like I said, I'm going to save that one over here. Because uh, I want to see. Probably won't sell these right away. Let's need to back up a little bit. There we go. I think they only hold a thousand liters. I should have done that while I was in the XML, XML file. Yep, 1,000 liters. Um, probably like, well, what are you going in the files for? Well, I had to go in the files to edit these boxes because they wouldn't accept premium or washed potatoes. You had to go in and change the fill type. Or was it the fill type? I don't know, Virtual Farmers got a uh, video on it, and I was going to save the link and stuff. If I get time, I'll put the link down below in the description, folks. But my my mind, oh, I got to get some more. I, I've been so busy and stuff, and now I'm busy trying to get it caught up with y'all comments. No, that's not no excuse. But it's just... Uh, 
It's a thing. It's just a thing, folks. Alright, so that's how you do it. You just pull up there, hit R, and it starts filling your bucket. Oh, stupid train in real life. They are extremely busy with the trains. It's probably about every hour we're getting a train running through in real life, folks. Alright, that should be full. And what I've been doing with the tractor over, of course, I've got to fill some of these buckets up. Oh, oh, no, no, no. In the bucket, please. There we go. These things are tricky. Tricky, tricky, tricky. But I'm going to sell a big load of potatoes. Then I'm going to sell these uh, boxes. So we can kind of know what we're getting. And then I want to... Let's see, I need to... Let me get some more right here. Get this one going. I want to try to get some pig food out of these. Um, while that's filling. As you can see here, we got lots of potatoes. I wish I could tell exactly how much we had here. But it's about two to three hundred thousand liters of potatoes there. This thing need to be filled up. I need to keep it. Turn on, turn on, there we go. Fill the potato washer back up. Okay, that's good. Probably gonna have to get some water for it. But yeah, here's the bags, and then we get bags of pig food, which is 300 liters each. I don't know if they're gonna stack up uh, or what. Wish we, they would spawn on a pallet. But I really don't want to do this. Uh, that's a lot of bags. I don't know what we're going to do. Uh, can we throw them in a trailer? I hope so. Um, let's see. Let me finish this. Got to go over here and finish this. And, uh, folks, I'm going to finish filling these up. And I'm going to bring you all back here in a little bit. I'm going to see if we can get some pig food in this episode. All right, folks. Right here, as you can see, this is washed potatoes. Two fifty six for the highest price there. Okay. This is the premium potatoes for four twenty five. Much better price. But it they're down. They're way down. And that is that port side grains, which port side grains is down here at the bottom. Um down by port side calf. Duh. Uh, while we're here, let's go ahead and get gold mine transportation done. Uh, windmill hill transportation done. We got two fertilizing and uh, one sowing that done. So that brings us to 50,308. We are going to pay back. Oh. Uh, 25,000 of that for right now just in case we need some stuff we have some money in our pocket I got the truck loaded up and um, all these are a thousand liters and I got a sack of potatoes here that's 500 liters and uh, I made a boo-boo I had one box that was 500 liters I put a bag of potatoes over it and it filled I'm like, no, but uh, I got, uh, oh, that was started. Oh, I left the tractor running. But what I'm probably going to do on the sack of potatoes, unless there's a real big difference in price, I'm just going to use these four machines we got here and I'll just keep them. Uh, working on them All right, that's full so that should go I want to do one thing before we take off from here to sell those I think Yes, this in here uh, 
has a thousand. So let's click on that. Max. Add. Oh boy. Um. <laughs> huh. Anybody's uh, uh, into the sixes? 6,666 liters an hour. Uh, Big Daddy, I guess I can't spawn them either. Hmm. They should have spawned it right here, I thought. Usually it's on this side. Stand right here. Maybe I was in the way. Oh, oh, spawn one pallet. I was in the way. Oh, wow. I was in the way, folks. Okay, uh, there's one pallet of pig food. Big Daddy, did you see that? I was standing right here and it wouldn't let me do it. And I moved over to the side and it spawned. We have one pallet of pig food. Yay! Okay, let's, let's go to this other one. Uh, was it this one? Uh, yes. Let's try this again. I'm going to stand right here on the square. And... Okay, see, so it won't let me do nothing. Alright, all oh, you YouTube farmers. You got to stand right here. And try to get close enough to do it. Uh-oh. There we go. You're going to have to be really... Wait, what? Oh, I thought... Oh, boy. Well, I got that in the spawn. Maybe I need to... Uh, see where this one's at. Uh, nope. Not nowhere near. Let me see if I can go on up here uh, that work nope oh man trying to trying to get like I was without being in the way of it Okay, it's not going to let me do on that. This isn't ready yet. Nope. This one. Nope. So I can spawn it for this one, so that tells me the rest of these are in the way of each other. That's, that was... Yeah, yeah, that's got pig food in it. Man, that burns me up. Okay, so we can spawn a pallet from here. Cause there's the proof. All right, let me. Uh, I guess what I'm gonna do is get. Oh, this one's gonna be in the way too. Man, I gotta do some serious thinking. Alright, let me get this truck here to the sale point and uh, see how much this bag of potatoes go for compared to the boxes. And uh, I'll meet y'all up here. Well, folks, I, I don't know if it's the same barge or not, but I haven't seen no barges come in or out. But, of course, I've only been here for about 10 minutes. Been inside talking to Jessica, and she's like, yeah, since we're slow, we can do this, so... Uh, we got a thousand liters here. We got 500 liters here. And they're um, going for 425 here at Portside Grain. And that's per thousand liters. So let's, let's do this little bad boy here first. 500 liters and let's see what we get. Y'all ready? Four hundred and twenty-five dollars. Wait, four hundred and twenty-five dollars. Wait, y'all, 
did the price go up that much? Eight hundred and fifty dollars. That's like four so. Maybe maybe that's what potatoes, bag potatoes go for. Or was it? I don't know. I, I didn't do no editing. Nothing. Let's see what this one goes for. Well, twenty five seven three three, and washed potatoes is at eight fifty now at Portside Grain. Six hundred twenty one dollars. Huh, I'm curious. I don't know too much about that. My mind's going bonkers right now, but we get it. Oh wait, it didn't sell all up. Oh man. Alright, let me grab another one. I thought all of it sold. That that just blew my mind right there. Yeah, I know my back's gonna be hurting me tomorrow. Lifting all these heavy pallets. Alright, can't set it down. Eight hundred and fifty dollars. That's more that's okay. Now my mind ain't boggling. Eight fifty for a thousand liters. That's what we got. Okay. Now I set this uh one here on the truck. Let me switch to the back. And you and then why. Okay, you saw the trailer drop. We're gonna start up. I don't think I need my straps on here. Alright, we are, what, short, let's see, three, yeah, we're short two boxes, so, let's go make some money. Okay. Oh, those are doing it. Oh, that's pretty good, 5,100 and 1,700. Why did the front one not do it? Because I wasn't on it. Trailer too high. I bet the trailer's too high. Alright, I'm going to auto load the back ones again. There we go. And switch to the front. And we're going to auto load. Then we're going to unload them. I have to do it by hand. Let's see if I can get right here without hitting anything. Oh, oh, that's gonna. Oh, why? It started to. Y'all see that? Man. All right, I'm gonna you right here to load boxes. Man, they had to be lifted up some so. Our front trailers was too tall. And our back trailer is just right. So we're going to have to remember that. And what? We'll, oh. I want to bring our big truck up here and dump it too. But we got to load more in it. I can raise that up pretty high and it sells out. I don't know why I didn't take it on the truck. All right, Jessica, we are out of here, girl. Thank you for your money. We're up to 39,000, folks. Nice. Now, if I had some more boxes, I could just put all the... That's a lot of... Well, the reason I don't want to do the boxes, folks, is because of the uh, lag we're going to have with that much stuff. Right, I'm going to put this on to follow, uh, to go to farmyard, yes. And I'll see y'all here in a minute. All right, I hope y'all can hear me over all this loud racket. I got my ear earmuffs in. Y'all seen this and spawn the pallet? It's uh, not quite ready for enough pallet, but this in here is three quarters away full of pig food. So let's go in here and go down. I'm doing it by the Xbox controller. Now I can spawn one pallet. X. All right, there we go. That's good. We're just going to kick it over here. 
you see what I done I moved the uh, the gimme auger or the conveyor belt out of the way this in here is also ready um, a little over half we'll go down I can spawn another pallet so yeah we're getting uh, 3,000 liters of pig food there let's chunk them over here the pigs going to be happy they're going to get some premium pig food aka uh, pieces of potatoes I guess I've uh, been filling the truck up uh, been taking care of these um, I did do uh, one fertilize contract while I was gone so I'm going to accept that uh, nothing else on the things except for transport kind of got the truck blocked in over there so it might be a little bit but I told them about it I'm going to go ahead and Oh, this one's probably out. Yeah, it's out of washed potatoes. Um, I think I'm just going to put just enough potatoes in here to get a little bit more pig food. As you can see, we got three bags there. And we got two bags here, but I'm accumulating a lot of small bags. And y'all know what that means in the FS19, especially if you don't have a good computer. I'm going to put a tiny bit more in these. Let's see this in here. No. Oh, well, we might be able to get one. Let's see if we can. Oh, yep, we can. All right. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to uh, go finish filling this truck up. It's almost full. And when we get it full, I'm going to go sell them. And then we're going to end the episode. So y'all hang around just a little bit more. I will be back. I'm going to power through these. Get the tractor started. The uh, compare. 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 No, not to compare. The conveyor belt over there. I had to scoot it back just a little bit more. Matter of fact, I probably need to. Um, yeah, there we go. Just have to hop in it and it'll fill it back up. Trying to keep that going. Uh, we're probably maybe a quarter way into the pile. So we're getting it slowly but surely. So this is probably going to be taking two or three episodes. I'm not going to do it all in three episodes. We're going to do some other things too. That's why I'm trying to do some of the contracts and stuff. And uh, I've been just doing like this. Keeping them emptied out till I get the truck full and uh yeah but the, these two here that makes the bags i'm gonna try to get it oh i don't bend them up first won't be able to take them back or bend them up uh get a little bit more out of them i don't think i feel like doing that many bags which um i'm gonna have to go back through the video i just uh, recorded for y'all uh not the last episode but this about five minutes for y'all which is probably about an hour for me so far um yeah i just wish i could sit down and record an episode all the way through without getting interrupted our truck's 55 percent full so when i get this full i'll bring y'all back and i'm sorry for another long episode but hang in there just a little bit more we'll go uh sell this truck stupid airplane not on the map folks in real life he's flying a little bit too low well, he's ain't flying over the water tire that's a big no-no for him he can get fined for that but anyway i will keep doing this until i get the trailer full oh whoa 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 okay i'd had a little fun there but uh i'll bring y'all back here in a second all right, we're back real quick. It is 3.30 in the evening, if you see the time up there. And uh, that nowhere is done. Let me show you here. Go up here, everything's emptied out of it. Folks, I do not want to do this. This is going to be hard getting all these sold. Yeah, I got potatoes for days. Uh, this in here is also done. 
You see we just got pig food left and to clear that out all you gotta do is just simply pick it up. I'm gonna take mine over here where it all be together. Let me get this now. Show you real quick. You go back in here. Everything's empty. So what I wanna do is go ahead. I'm gonna put these over. Well, I had it almost where I could grab both. These little bitty things are, uh, they're okay, but they are very, very hard to deal with if you don't have uh, good controller nerves. But this one here is only 238 liters, 238, so there's like two bags in there that's small. But we're going to go in here, we're going to sell these real quick. We're going to go to the garage, please, oh, thank you. Oh, going too far. I was hoping it would still be here. All right, here's the difference in them. You can see these two here are the older version, the one that's not updated. This is the updated one. And they are the ones that does the potato sacks. What I've done, when, when you download, I, I'll make another video of it, I, I guess. Uh, just a quick explaining. You download it. Yes, I want to sell it. Fourteen thousand going back into her bank account. I didn't see it move. Let's see, I'm gonna go out. Make sure I get that. And yes, okay. But it's not gonna show it. So we got these four left here. Not gonna sell them yet until all the potatoes are done. Oh man, it left a stain on my on my pavement here. Concrete stain. But anyway. We got to sell all these. That'll be the next episode. I'm going to get them onto a trailer and strap them down. We'll go sell them. And uh, the pig food. Um, let me go to the pig pigs and I'll be right back, folks. I'm going to show you something. All right. Our pigs are even. 222 on the soybeans, canola, sunflowers. Wheat and barley is 222. And corn is 444. Four. And we're going to... If I can find it again. There we go. Give them this and see what it brings it to. Um, didn't take all of it? Or did I not put it? Oh, guys. Oh, wrong one. Go in here. Oh, they are full. 250, 250, 500. Okay, good. So we'll leave that little bag. I want to put this little bag over on the other side so we can see it. Yeah, right there. Okay, piggies, y'all eat and grow. I don't know for sure, folks. It's been a few minutes since I recorded, but I think this was 850 where I go. And it's 854. But we're up here at Portside Grains. And uh, we got a load of potatoes. We got. Uh, let me get in the dark so I can see. 69,800 liters of pretend, for blah, 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 premium potatoes. And well, uh, what was it? Jessica, I think her name was. Sorry if I, I can't remember. But yeah, she's fixing to get a whole truckload of them. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Look at that money. Oh, the money, money, money going up. Oh, yeah. Get it right there where y'all can see it. Oh my, folks. I want, just want to take this time. Thank you for coming out and watching me. 29827 for that truckload. And we still got more. We got a lot more. So that brings us up to 76. Ooh, can I get this trailer out of here? That's the question. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Look here. Oh, yeah. Mr. Blue can drive a truck. All right, Jessica. Appreciate your business, girl. And we're going to go up here. And uh, I'm going to get... I'm going to get Mr. Yankee to drive his truck back. We need to go to Farmyard. And... Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. I want you to go. Got to go this way. Alright, uh, you should catch it right there, okay. Alright, 
uh, let's go back to the farm. Folks, in the next episode, I will explain this. The TLX 3500 from 82 Studios. I just thought y'all might want to see that. But, got to go over here. Um, or almost full. 90,000 be full. 73,000 now. Um, got to get some water for the greenhouses. And and for this here too because it's uh, about halfway on water almost and folks I just want to show you look here you're going to take up my last thumbnail or picture or whatever and see our potatoes was probably about to right here and I say we got about right at halfway maybe not quite but maybe y'all be the judge of that Right now, I'm at a uh, slowdown. Uh, this thing here is going so you can see it. Wash potatoes, not very much. Water and potatoes, it's good. I'm up here and look. The hopper's low, so I'm caught up. Uh, I need this thing to catch up. So, uh, get this. So, I think I'm going to take this in here. When it gets maxed out on premium and pig food, I'm just gonna empty it all out and then sell this one and just use three. Cause I can't keep up. Look at the hoppers of these. I'm just about out. This one's just about out. And that one's just about out. I just feel this one up. Probably the last time I fill it up. But I'm gonna get it down. Did it like I did these other two. We'll just drop down to three cause it's getting where I can't, these things can't keep up with the washer, so. Ain't no sense having them around if we can't. Oh, that just quit. It's empty. Yep. Uh, I'm going to put some more in it. I'm not going to put too many more potatoes in it. Well, this one I can, but this one here. I want to empty it out. And I want to show y'all. Let's see. I've been. Um, this one here. I've been taking it and filling these potato boxes when I had the skid steer up here. And this is what we got left. Let me get my drone out real quick. Get it started. Have I got my drone on? Uh, I do now. Let's fly. And uh, next episode, we're going to sell these potatoes. I got them all loaded on a truck. And they're strapped down and ready to go. And uh, I'm loaded this on the trailer without the auto load. I just dropped them here. And I'm stacking boxes on top. Um... Uh, six be seven more boxes um yeah i'm gonna fill these up too i'm gonna fill these boxes up put them on there and then i'll start filling this semi back up but folks that's gonna be it for today um yeah i hope y'all enjoyed it and big daddy mr jim i hope y'all enjoyed it too but anyway, got to get off here, folks. I love each and every one of y'all. Y'all are awesome. Um, I just appreciate everything, folks. Y'all are awesome to me. Really awesome. Really awesome. Well, got a text. But anyway, y'all have a great day. A blessed day. And I'll see you in the next episode. Later. Later.